Stop. Are you under 13? If so, you must turn back. This video is not for you. This video has been deemed inappropriate for you. Stop. Turn back. Don't hit that play button. Get out of here. That we got coming out. Damn it. Hey, what's up, guys? It's EBJJ Comic Nut coming at you with another review. Another Marvel Legends review, to be exact. This time, we're going to be reviewing a... Target exclusive. This is a hard piece to get a hold of. Uh, from what I hear, they're only sending out one of these per store, and they're not even sending them out to every store. I had to travel about an hour away to get this action figure. So this Red Hulk, if anybody knows any history on Red Hulk, uh, is a play on generous General Thaddeus E. Uh, Thunderbolt Ross, who is a enemy to guess who? The Incredible Hulk. It's a great figure. I, I think we need a few of these because the, the bath that they made was didn't look good to me. I don't, I don't like the way they they um they came out with it, the, the design and the structure and the sculpture. Just it wasn't really what I uh, envisioned the Red Hulk being. And then they came out with uh, the, what is it, the uh, Select, which I didn't like either. So we're gonna crack this bad boy open and see uh, what what it looks like after the intro. So here we have the Red Hulk out of its case or you know its box. It looks awesome. I'm glad we. It's the same body sculpt as the or Wolverine uh, Hulk two pack, uh, which I'm not really mad at because they did give us a different uh, head sculpt. They didn't just reuse that head sculpt and just paint it red, which is great. Uh, they changed the color of the pants to a darker gray. They did nice coloring on the, the his body. There are just a couple little areas of discoloration, a couple little things here that uh, we could pro like right here in the bicep, there's like a little mold thing right here. Um, let's check it out together. A lot of uh, seam on his hands. Uh, other than that, man, he looks pretty good, man. We do have the peg holes, double jointed knees, Double jointed elbows, he does move at the bicep, his wrist move up and down, and they twist. And here is your uh, not a really lot of ab crunch splitting, and really do pretty good splits there. You know, his, his arms move really well again. You know, we get the bicep, he moves at the shoulder and at the bicep, so we can and they move up and down. So that's pretty cool. His Ankles don't rotate, his shins don't rotate, but he does have rotation at the thighs, which is pretty cool. And his face sculpt, let me pop that off <clears throat> so you guys can see this a little bit better. See that? That looks really good. They've got his tongue in there, his teeth, I mean... That looks really, really good. His hair, everything just looks, his eyes, right on his eyebrows, he's got like uh, some glazing, which looks good. Ah, man, his tongue and teeth and all that look great. His ears, they did a really good job on this sculpt, guys. This sculpt is like really good. And I'm going to have problems putting, give me a second. All right, well, the one thing that I do wish on this particular figure is that the head would move back a little bit more because I would like to have both of these hands on, like in the air a little bit, and him like screaming at the air like he's changing or going through some pain or something. It, the, the figure looks great, though, guys. You know, there's really, you know, his nails are painted. They do have a lot of details on the hands. I was hoping that they didn't use like the old... Um, not the old one, but the body from Juggernaut. I was hoping they didn't do that, but they did use the body from this Hulk here. So if we stand them side by side, we will see that the bodies are exactly the same. Head sculpts are different. Uh, you could see the veins are the same there. Veins are the same here. A lot less noticeable seams on this hand which is pretty cool. His teeth are not as nice as these as far as like, you know, 
uh, coloration. These are a little bit faded and they're dripping down onto the lip. Uh, there's a little green in the hair on that one, but you know, overall, and then if you notice the pants are exactly the same, it, you know, they got the rips in the same, the jeans are the same. The only thing is it's different is the color of both of them. Uh, so this Hulk does come with two pair of hands. He has one closed fist and one open. Uh, it comes with these two, the right arm closed and the left one open like, like that. Uh, and then here are the other two which, you know, you can see on the knuckles, there is really good detail on the knuckles, man. See right here, and right there. Inside, you can see, like in the palms, he's got really good, his thumb, even his thumb, on these right here. Oh, there's little indents in there, too, making that look really good. Wow. They did a really good job. Um, this one, these are the same hands from the Green Hulk. I just didn't really look at them in depth. You can see so much more the darker the, the skin color as far as the, the, the mold goes, the way they did that. That looks really good. I'm going to do a quick height comparison, which I really shouldn't have to do, but I'm going to do anyway for those of you who really want to see scale or don't have this Hulk or haven't seen it. So I'll be right back. All right, guys, here's our size comparison. We have Old School Wolverine that came in a two-pack uh, with the other Green Hulk next to our Thaddeus Ross Red Hulk, uh, General Thaddeus Ross. Uh, so, you know, overall, the height difference is to scale. It looks really good uh, for those of you that are scale Nazis. I don't know the height of the Hulk, what he's supposed to be. I think what here is a six and a half, seven feet almost because he's, what, five and a half feet? So you're looking at maybe even, what, three, four feet. So he's probably eight feet, maybe, give or take-ish. I don't know. I haven't really looked at the bio of the Red Hulk, see what size he is. But you, as you can see for yourself, this is definitively uh, scalable. You can put them together to fight eat with the, you know, the other Hulk because they look exactly the same. Or with Wolverine or any one of the other Thaddeus uh, enemies or people, you know, or whatever, man. It's, it, you can have hours and hours of fun taking photos of him in different poses, you know, outside with smoke and him screaming. So this is going to be a really fun character to, to deal with because... To, to work with because he does look a lot better than the old ones. Uh, they've really stepped up the game with this particular figure. Uh, anyway, guys, if you like this video, I know it was short, sweet, to the point. Uh, but anyway, if you did like it, go down to the bottom, click like, hit subscribe if you haven't already done so, and hit that notification bell. So when we here at the channel upload a new video, you can get notified and you can go straight to our, or come straight to our channel so that way you can, uh, you can watch all of the new badass videos. All right, guys. All right, guys, see you on the flip side and peace.